Hey Pisces, what's up Pisces? It is Ashley here at Fire Intuition. I am here to do your collective love reading. Alrighty. Um, this is going to be for all Pisces. Please do only take what resonates with you. Never force it to fit. Before we hop in, y'all, tomorrow is the 28th. Y'all know tarot class starts tomorrow. Um, if you guys are interested in signing up, you guys can still do so. All the information is in the description box below. Also, pin in the comments as well. All right, so let's hop in, Pisces. Let's see what's going on with you guys. Oh, sorry. Let's start out with some love messages for you, Pisces. Okay. I wish you peace, happiness, and love. Let's see. I think about you as soon as I open my eyes. Okay. So they go to sleep thinking about you, wake up thinking about you. Let's see. I feel like you are better off without me. I messed up. I know that. All right. You'll forever be in my heart. Okay. So somebody, I just feel like they, they feel like they, like somebody sabotaged something. It's like, I feel like they know like, oh, I know I sabotage this. I need you in my life again. Let's see. Mm -hmm. I'm just getting like a sabotage energy. I wasn't completely honest and I regret that. Okay, so they regret not being completely honest with you about something. So let's see. Okay. Right, let's see. So we got the page of wands. There could be some good news coming in, messages coming in. All right, let's see, Pisces. So let's see how this person feels towards you. All right, so we have the temperance in reverse and the four of cups. So this is somebody that is like, they got an attitude with you because of some shit they did. That's what this is. A selfish one, but already. It can be a Sagittarius, but whoever this is, they got added to a chew over something they did. I can tell you that right now. What they're hiding from you is Ace of Swords speaking to you, telling the truth, being honest with you about something. All right. Ace of Pentacles reverse. This is where you stand in their life. So you guys are in a relationship or any type of commitment right now. We have the Sun. We have the King of Pentacles. We have the Nine of Swords. Okay. So let's see what's going on, Pisces. With this person... Okay. All right. So you guys aren't in a relationship. All right. They need. They gotta do some work for sure. It's gonna take a lot for them to get you back. All right. Let's see, Pisces. So we got this four of cups here. This is how they feel towards you. I have the four of cups here. They feel like you're rejecting them, ignoring them, like you don't want to be with them, don't want to hear them out. Ten of pentacles in reverse. So what's done is done. Queen of cups. Like, oh, I'll always love you, but I don't see myself being with you anymore. That can be your energy towards them. Like, oh, I love you. I'll care. I care about you. I always love you and care about you, but I can't see myself with you no more. Yeah, the chariot, you moving on. Okay. And then we have the star. You just feel like it's best to move on and to heal from this. Um I feel like with this high priestess in reverse, so let's see. I feel like for some of you guys, eventually you might come back around or you might come around. But I feel like for right now, there was too much that was revealed. And you don't know how you feel when it comes to a lot of things. There's a lot of secrets or a lot of things that came out, a lot of things that were hidden that were revealed to you. And this is why you feel like this. And you're just kind of like her, like, damn, like, I love you. I trust that you, you know, I still love you, but I just can't be with you right now. I got to focus on me. Okay, so let's see how this ace of swords is here. This is what they're not telling you. So they weren't telling you some type of truth, but it looks like it was revealed to you anyway. And if it wasn't, it's about to be temperance, something that's going to have you upset. You guys are going to get into it. It has to do with a relationship. Let me see. Eight of cups in reverse. Hmm. Page of swords. So what was they telling somebody about you? So they were talking shit about you to somebody else just to get closer to them. For somebody else to like them. So they were talking bad about you guys. Being, you know, saying stuff about you. Being rude, disrespectful. Or saying that you guys are rude or disrespectful. Or, 
you know, you like just they were just talking bad about you. Like, oh, I want to leave them. This is not where I want to be. You guys could find out or found out. Yeah, but they were doing it, like I said, to get this other person to get closer to them so that they can get their foot in in that situation, okay? And then for some of you guys, they went kind of cold on you or withdrew from you um, just so they can give in to this other situation. So they were like fooling the both of you, playing both sides. It's awesome bullshit, you know? Um, but they were, you know, they were talking bad on your name and saying a lot of negative stuff about you or, you know, talking about you to someone. Why is the Ace of Pentacles reverse? The Wheel of Fortune. This is where you sit in your life. So, yeah. It's like one of you guys are ready to move on. You feel like it's over. It's done. You feel like they're never going to commit to you or give you anything serious. But it's like you do care for them, but this is how you feel. And for some of you guys, it's like you have no regrets. So, it's like they have regrets. Like I said, they sabotage this. They regret everything that happened. And they honestly don't know where they stand in your life. They don't know where they stand. They don't know where they stand in your life. And um, that's what they're trying to figure out. But you guys don't want nothing to do with them. And whoever this is that they got closer to, you know, and talked about you to, to get closer to, I don't even feel like they're with that person or dealing with that person. Why are just lovers here? King of Wands and Birds. And I tell you guys, look, they did all that just to get close to somebody, just to fuck or just to be, I don't People do dumb shit. I'm just going to leave it there. But they just, I mean, mm -hmm. Unless that's how they really felt. But I feel like they shouldn't have, you know, down, talk down on you and said negative things about you to somebody else. And then all of a sudden, now they regret not being honest and they sabotage if someone's too bad. That's stupid. All right, let's see. Pisces, how do they feel towards you? Yep, they were roaming wild. Just acting free and single and just doing all type of shit. Taking risks. Okay? Now they want to reflect and think about what they did after stepping out on you and taking risks and stuff. Apprehensive. So you guys can be guarded, cautious right now, afraid, all right? Because you guys feel conflicted due to everything that was going on, all right? Them having other choices, beauty. So for some of you guys, they're coming around being nice and charming or they're complimenting you guys a lot, trying to apologize to you so they can return. They want your forgiveness. All right, so let's see. The sun is here. Two of wands in reverse. See, look, the other person, look, wow, this is crazy. So, they played you for somebody else only to get played. <sighs> that person was being patient with them at first, but seeing them for who they really were are just, like, lost interest in them. Mm -hmm. It was like a little lustful connection. It was cool. It was good for, you know, a few weeks, you know. But, let me see. They really thought they was going to be in a little relationship with this person. Hmm. Yep, things were going good. They had that person excited. Had them thinking they were going to have something. They got in that person's head. And whoever they were dealing with saw the bullshit. Saw the bullshit and cut them off. But the thing is, is that they played them for somebody else. It's like, so what I'm getting is like, they played you only to get played because they were talking about you to get closer to somebody. They got closer to them and this person, the sun, shining the light on things, saw them for who they really were. They were like, oh, I'll be patient with you. I understand. The whole time, they had an ex-lover or somebody else that they were fucking or talking to. Things were cool between them and this person for a while, but then they switched up on them and started talking to somebody else. They thought they had this person in their head about them. Whoever they were talking to, that talk, they talked bad on you to. They thought they had this person in their head and stuck on them. But that person was betraying them and talking and texting and fucking somebody behind their back anyway. The whole time or like, you know, eventually down the line. So they got played, like I said, and moved on. <laughs> They're not even talking to your person. All right. So with the King of Pentacles, um, what's blocking you guys from moving forward is the King of Pentacles. Them being solid, offering commitment. See, King of Swords in reverse. They too busy trying to keep secrets and be cold and talk about you and be a player and got played and lost a committed relationship. And now they want to come back and love on you and be all nice and, oh, I fucked up. I regret not telling you the truth. Like, let me make it up to you, baby, and all this stuff. Like, mm. let's see, Nine of Swords for the future, for their future intentions. They they just going to be stressed out. Yep, because you gave up on their ass. Magician, Six of Pentacles. Y'all are manifesting somebody better, whether it's an equal give and take or it's like... um. 
more money or something that's coming in for you guys. You guys are opening new, something new. You guys are glowing, looking good, looking fine. Y'all gonna have y'all a little hot girl summer, okay? Y'all gonna meet y'all little hoochie daddy or something like that. Okay, because y'all got something going on, Pisces. Pisces, like, I'm not here to play games. Y'all got, um, y'all are manifesting, like, somebody uh, that has money or something. Y'all are going to meet somebody that has money that's going to spoil you, that's going to do a lot of things for you. It may be temporary, it may not be, but right now, y'all worried about you, Pisces. And that's all you can do. And if they were a burden. See, they rejected you. And look, now this person is not responding. Neither are you. Unresponsive. Okay? Not answering their calls, not talking to them, nothing. Mm -mm -mm -mm. So we got burdens. We got behavioral issues. What is this about? Yep, you guys could have been dealing with a Capricorn or somebody that got behavioral issues. Rejected. PTSD. Let's see. Yep, because all the trauma for all the lives them stepping out on you over and over again. You guys are celebrating quietly. All right, remember I told you somebody is going to do a lot of things for you. All the stuff that you gave is being returned to you. Whoever this is, like somebody is coming in and winding down, you spend a lot of money on you, do you good. Isolation, it can be an isolation. Let's see, the higher font. Yeah, some of them are, somebody is going to a counselor, you know, oh, you know, to talk to somebody, but. You're not responding to them. Why is this higher font here? To a cup. Somebody is going to somebody to talk to them about this relationship. They're trying to get some help, some guidance. You know, speak to somebody to see if this is something that could be saved. Or they're going to their church, their pastor, their priest. Or, you know, or just going to somebody that they can confine in and talk to. It's the higher font. They might be real religious, you know. Or, like I said, go to church or something like that. And they're like wanting to talk to somebody. Are they wanting to talk to somebody that is like married or committed or in some type of relationship? They're trying to get some type of advice. Let's see what we got for you, Pisces. What do your um, angels have to say? This situation will improve. Yeah, without they ask. Yeah, it will because you're about to recover. You're recovering from them. That's why I ask your angels. Let's see. Yes, and compromise. Some of you guys are going to compromise and give into this. For others of you, you're ready to move on. And recover and go towards another opportunity and you will for some of you guys you have a new opportunity and work with work or something you're working on okay oh excuse me oh sorry pisces excuse me bless me times three yeah so you guys have a new opportunity coming in with you guys for work okay or with work so congratulations with that all right pisces but this is your reading if it resonated please do like share comment subscribe hit that bell and if you guys would love to book, fireintuition.com. Bye, y'all.